And right now we are about to get into a very interesting conversation, which mm. you're going to be watching some videos. Mm. And it's all about the Heritage Caravan, Caravan. which started mm. yesterday. yesterday. You were here. How was yes, it? It was amazing. Yeah. And oh, yeah, we, we call ourselves now the Egg Committee. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Egg Committee. We were frying egg, the entire breakfast we had. Um, all the English breakfast, mm -hmm. all the kinky, all the music. Mm -hmm. It was interactive. And the fact that I was listening to the interviews that Charles Hosukumi yeah. was having with the new onboarders, mm -hmm. I was amazed. Most of them were about, I could count 10 mm -hmm. with the old ones, the old patrons who have been enjoying it right. for the past years, and the new ones who heard it from a friend to a friend to a friend. And oh my darling, it was amazing. The fact that one said, my sister came on the train. She enjoyed it so much and she learned the history of certain parts on the trip of Ghana right. that she didn't know about. Mm -hmm. And she encouraged her to make sure she joined this year. That is why she decided to join this year. And yesterday, when they got to Akwati Mekpetoi, oh my days, the Derba was amazing. The chiefs and people were ready to, to, to usher them into what they are having as a cultural value, right. as history that they are learning. And the fact that our people were able to do an enactment of the kente weaving, not just um, seeing it, but experiencing how kente is woven yeah. and I, the history I, yeah. behind kente. I, I actually think that's a very good experience mm. and every everyone, everyone should experience it. Have, you, have you ever tried weaving it? My sister. No, I have, I have, I have. Like, go? And yeah, it's it, it's so much fun. I think, like like I said, I think everyone should true, um, true. Um, try and experience it. Anyway, um, it's um, fourteen regions in eight days. But we actually have a video for you. We promised that we're going to be bringing you diaries of what's going on there. So we have Kweku, um, Kweku David right on this video. Check it out, and we'll be right back. So we're here at the Volta Serene Hotel, beautiful place to be in the heart of Ho. Now listen, yesterday was a fantastic journey that we had, right from Ula Hansen, number five, Ula Hansen Lane in Tessano, Accra, Ghana. Now we set off, uh, of course, after a wonderful breakfast that we had there at the city gardens. It was an amazing experience, beautiful breakfast, all the different things, different options were there. Now, when we set off, went straight to the Volta region. Now, we did a quick um, stop to sort of like a rest our legs and, you know, um, stretch our legs a little bit and all of that in the Volta region. And then we headed straight for Agotine. Now, when we got to Agotine, there was a beautiful Kente display and a Derba that we experienced. It was beautiful. Then they gave us a bit of a history of what, how they came about, you know, in Agotine. And then, of course, the taste of Toto Papa. Yes, beautiful, beautiful food there eaten in the Volta region. We experienced that as well. And of course, um, I enjoy particularly the Baobab drink, right? And, uh, you know, there's so many things to enjoy in Ghana and all of that. You, know, you, you don't want to miss the Heritage Caravan. And I'm going to be bringing you updates as the days go by, what we're experiencing. And then, of course, we came to the Volta Serene Hotel from Agotime, Pet Boy. We got here to the Volta Serene Hotel to come and party the night away. Of course, in Chin Chin Ban was on point last night. I'm telling you, from all the golden, uh, golden oldies, you know, the music from um, High Life Classics to um, the music from the 60s and 70s that we remember, the discos and all of that, that happened last night. It was amazing. Going to Chimba, took us into the night, and then we all went to bed to go rest. Then this morning, up bright and early, here at the Volta Serene Hotel, we're heading out. We've just had breakfast. Everybody's ready. Yeah, all taking photos and getting snapshots and all of that. You can get to see some of them and all that. But we're heading to the Eastern region to the famous Rock City. Yes, Rock City Hotel um, in uh, Abetifi in the Volta, in the Eastern region. We're gonna go there. Now, the trip from here to there, quite a long one, gonna be a scenic one because we're moving through the Volta region into the Eastern region. Now, guess what? Tonight, 
DJ Mingo is going to be on, and so we're looking forward to that. So stay with us. We're going to bring you more updates on that heritage caravan. This is day two, the day two morning. It feels nice to wake up, to wake up, to wake up and not be on breakfast daily. <laughs> hey guys, enjoy yourselves on the set. I'm enjoying myself roaming through the country. See you later. Wow, we can all see that Kweku is enjoying himself. And if you've been watching the show since last week, you know that he has been very excited about this trip. And it's nice to see that he's really enjoying himself. But more of this is going to be coming up as they go through different regions. We are going to be getting updates. But if you're not watching and you just want to, you know, see, you know, the other side that we can't show you on screen, all you need to do is follow us on our social media pages, especially on Instagram, City TV, GH, that's where everything it's happening, especially the behind the scenes that won't be on TV. <laughs> right.